Is that a Pagani Waira? It is. Look at that 918 spider over there. Blacked out. Look at that. That's super cool. You got a singer in front of it. Look at that. That's a nice one. Hmm, a lot of Porsches in Montana. Yeah. What a spec. Another singer. I don't think that's a singer. It is. Are you sure? Yeah, look at the look at the rear uh look at the badge on the rear. Look at that white interior. That is just balling. Yeah. Hennessy. Alright. Look at the quail. Yeah. Look at that. Cheers to that. Here. Turn around. So this is the quail, which is considered the most exclusive and expensive automotive event on the planet. Lots of showcasing here. Conan say Gamera. Yeah, that's uh, pretty wild. Wow. Um, wow. Looks pretty good for for the amount of usage here. Yeah, I'll say. Wow. This is the new turbo by Singer. That is wild. The wheels in this thing. Sauce comes out the rear. Subtle. Pornographic. That is slightly pornographic. Look at those center lock BBS wheels. That's the kind of project you'd really enjoy at work. 345s. Carbon fiber lines up perfectly. And the Hispano Suiza. Whoa. So, the battery is, is not a skate. Cheers. Cheers. Takia. Takia. Look at this. It's the new EV9 SUV. That's a pretty cool design. I like it. I'll tell you, Kia's really nailing in their styling lately. Are you Huge fan of Aston Martin. Yes. This is the new one. What is this? I uh, can't remember the name, but that is a pretty wild design. And you got the new DB. A couple quick McLarens. a uh, McLaren P1 GTR. A McLaren P1 HDK. Look at that exhaust. Yeah. With the weird headlights. A 350 GT. Those are so rare. Yeah, Lotus over here. They're switching to EV. This is their new hypercar, mega car, whatever you call mega cars these days. That little steering wheel. I'll tell you, Lotus's interior quality has come a long way since the original releases. The new Lotus SUV. Look at that paint finish. Wow. I've always loved these. Although this is a three three sixty five. Wow. Seventy four. Not just one nine five nine. Two three four five six seven eight nine. Wow. Look at this spec. All black. That's the way I like it. Canopa. This 
some Hennessy's. Hey, Brian, you see that Gunther works? I sell lights for those. <laughs> That's a Morgan Motor Yes, it is. Nice etch. Gunther Works, man. They have some nice looking cars. Look at that. It's the new Zenvo. That's a pretty color. I don't like using the word pretty, but that's a pretty color. That's the new Hennessy. I believe that one is owned by Sir Michael Jordan of the Chicago Bulls. What are these little guys? They're electric. Look at these headlights though, man. We gotta do something about that. Minx, so cool. hit me up. We got some options for you. How are you guys doing? Really? Heck yeah. So cool. Look at those. Thank you, Roof. Those are really nice looking taillights. Look at that. Ready? Mustang GTD, probably seen it all over your Facebook feed. 300 grand, all carbon fiber body, 800 horsepower, 5.2 liter supercharged V8. Nice job, Ford. It's pretty special. Active suspension. Yeah. We'll see how that works on the track, but yeah, I like it. That's a pretty far departure from the normal Mustangs you're used to see on the road. Pretty exciting stuff. So these are so loud that you like can't even use them on any racetrack. NAB12. I think they did the Nurburgring in six minutes and 47 seconds. Correct me if I'm wrong, people. Still a pretty amazing sight. Look at that. Ooh, got the tack and the steering wheel. Yeah, 647, look at that, spot on. The original Zonda. That is just awesome. This is the new Pagani. Yeah, woe is right. Yeah, that's, uh, that's called the Utopia. And it is a work of art, like every Pagani. That is the Utopia. The unveiling Marcos is called at Pagani, simultaneously. I mean, look at this interior. Look at that. That is just, yeah, as Brian stated, straight pornographic. Look at the titanium exhaust, AMG built motor. Yeah, that, that is very, very special. Their signature exhaust design on their most famous car, in my opinion, this is the Zonda S. Yeah, the Zonda S is just such a special car. Look at that carbon fiber duckbill. Manual, look at that interior before airbags were legally required. Uh, yeah, that's a uh, pretty nice spec. They're spinning Farina. Last year I had to sign an NDA when I saw the unveil of the Pure Vision. Pretty sweet. Quail is definitely the best event I've ever been to, and that is saying a lot. I've been to a lot of car events. I found Matt. We found Matt, our colleague. TRS Matt. TRS Matt. Straight up, this Kia EV9. I'm digging it. Maybe some different wheels, but that is really cool. So we're gonna go look at that. Oh yeah, and then you got Ferrari. Look at that. There's our boy Matt, the F50. See the Merit guy, Michael. That's car number two. I think he has 3,800 miles on it. This guy's excited. Oh yeah, look at that thing. There's so this is our friend Matt Kossoff's Ferrari F50. This is car number two ever built. It has 3,800 miles on the clock. 
And uh, this is the kind of car that when you have a friend that is very successful and has built something, you're really proud to see this. I mean, this thing is in perfect condition. Our friends at Merit Partners in Atlanta, they take really good care of it for them. And I mean, this is just a really special car, right? So, this is a V12. Oh. How many miles? 3,800? 3,800, yeah. 3,800. It's a gated manual. They just don't make a like this anymore. Even a hybrid car. I mean, carbon fiber shift knob. Look how basic the steering wheel is. It doesn't have an airbag or anything. Like, I love that about this. It is a 1995. There's a lot more government regulations now. So you can have a car like this from the past have the most fun possible. This is all about the driving experience. This is an enthusiast car. It has roll-up windows. You know what else has roll-up windows? My 2004 Toyota Tacoma. Basically the same thing. And frankly, you know, this is why you work hard. You work hard so you can buy stuff like this and have fun. He's going to be taking this up to Big Sur this week. And, uh, you know, we're happy for him because he earned it. And, uh, and I'm just glad that we've been part of that team. This is uh, a really special car. And um, it's just awesome. Just awesome to be sitting here. And colleague, somebody who sells automotive lighting products has made it to this point. So kudos to you, Matt. And um, if you are in the market for the finest example of a 1995 Ferrari F50, probably on the planet, rumor has it, this one is for sale. So that would be available through Merit Partners. I'm just going to go to the website. We're here all day. 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 We're here all day.
good vibes. We got some uh, nice mezcal here. Pretty good vibes. It's a good spot. He's wearing a race suit, but I don't know what's going on there, but it's pretty cool. David Lee's got quite a Ferrari collection, must be said. David's car? 